So there's a big difference between getting it and chasing it. The moment that you're chasing it, you ain't getting it. The moment that you're getting it, you're never chasing it. And the reality is, it's like once you start making money, it's like it just flows to you. And it's like the moment you chase it, just like anything in life, you never get what you chase. It's like the person that's chasing a rabbit or they're chasing five rabbits at the same time. They're not going to catch one. And it's just like making money is an art form. And once you understand how to make money, it just becomes natural to you. It's just like, have you ever seen a person that's chasing a girl around that they'll never get? Have you ever seen anybody that's successful need to chase because it just comes to them? So it's like your aura, your energy is really what determines who you attract and what you don't attract. So it's like if you're not making any money right now, it's typically because I would say a couple of things, right? Either you lack specialized skills, you're not putting in the work, or it's just like maybe it's not meant for you to happen right now at this time. Maybe it's like a building block, but nothing happens overnight. So it's like if you're looking to get rich quick, it will probably never really happen to be honest with you. You might win the lottery. You can win the lottery, keep the money for a little bit, then you're going to lose all the money. So it's just like never ever chase it. What's meant to be is meant to be. What's yours is yours and what you are meant to have, you will have. So it's like right now, if you're working at a nine to five job and you're just figuring it out, that's okay. If you're, you know, don't have a job, not making any income, it's okay. Don't go do anything crazy that makes you start chasing money because the moment you start chasing something, you just never get it. I don't know why. It just is what it is, right? So it's just like if you want to make more money and you want to really figure this out quickly, it's just like what are you, what, what do you need to do to get the results that you want? Do you want to get a promotion? If you need to get a promotion, go talk to your manager. What do you need to get that promotion? Do you want to start your own business? If you do want to start your own business, what industry do you want to start your business in? Do you want to like, um, you know, do a joint venture partnership? Do you want to learn how to invest your money? Like whatever it is that you want to do, there's a way to do it, but you just have to be strategic about it. You have to like be patient with yourself. You have to realize like Rome wasn't built in a day. Making money doesn't happen overnight. But the moment that you figure out what your calling is and what your path is, everything is just going to start flowing to you. It's like water. You see water flowing down a creek. It's just kind of flowing at its own pace. And that's exactly how it is when it comes to making money. It's just like, you know, you make your first hundred thousand then you make your first million then you make your first 10 million. But if you're struggling to make your first 10,000, struggling to make your first 50,000, struggling to make your first 100,000, it's like, why are you struggling? What is it that you need to do to minimize the amount of struggling to actually start getting the results that you want? And once you figure out those things, that's when you stop chasing. So it's like, well, you need to figure out what do you need to do so you don't have to chase and then it starts coming to you. And typically it's like, like I said, it's building specialized skills, knowing the right people, and it's also even changing your environment. Sometimes changing your environment is the fastest way to like have that wealth start coming to you. So if you're in a really poverty stricken mindset, you're in the projects, you're around a bunch of people that don't like making money, that think money's evil, like, oh my gosh, people that make money, they're bad. That's kind of like some of the energy that you'll attract. So it's like you have to remove all the negative energy around you. If you're around people that look at $100 like it's going to change their life forever, it's like get away from all those people. Like you really got to be centered in on what you want and you got to be centered in with like who you are to realize like, okay, like what is for me is for me and it's going to come to you. And it's just like, but if you're around people that are distracting you from it, it's just another negative layer that goes to chasing money. It's like, you know, if you're one of those people that go to the bar every single week and you spend all your money, but you don't spend any money to invest in yourself, you're not going anywhere far. I mean, you're not going anywhere fast. I, I know where you're going. So it's just like really figuring out what is it that you want? What is it that you need to do to get it? And then everything will just come together. It's like, and sometimes it's just really keeping it simple. Just keep everything simple, but don't ever chase anything because... The person that chasing never gets it. I'm going to keep it at that. And uh, I hope that helped you guys. Like, don't chase it. Just get it. Because what's meant for you is meant for you. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.